I've never written a work line. GD has never written if, a work line. <laughs> if you can come up with a work line that I've written, yeah. the joke is on you. Was, that means you the dumb. <laughs> <laughs> And I you didn't get it. My, my name is Marcus, <laughs> and I approve I that approve message. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He has never written a watch line. Sisa jiba lazy, tima tiko no langa tizili mpa lazy, tinda chido ya mwila ndaya mbaga lazy, mstairo mango sintanga tida lazy, nikila nikuli teka hezi mpa lazy, apana wongo sisi langa ti ayezi, nikukulu tamiso zinga ti anyezi, send a shock to your body gadi magenti, hold up, chete, chika mbilane, eh, ena wangu kwera kumandi mame, eh, majutuzi abida sama name, eh, But welcome to podcast with Mike Nyoni. Uh, this is a special, special edition. I'm about to scream, but uh, <laughs> these are the rooms. So yeah. we're shooting uh, at Malawi Sunny. Um, for, for some reason, yeah. For some reason, I'm like, hey, she, to get a good price, I'm like, it's yeah, difficult to yeah, get yeah. So yeah, we're shooting at Malawi Sunny. So um, I can scream because some of these things are rooms. Nah, it's all but good. yeah, it's we're going to do this one. So mm. Welcome to podcast with Mike Nyoni. This is a very exclusive and exciting podcast because i have the dead devils yeah yeah ah, thank you crazy, thank you for man. having us man thank yeah, you yeah, yeah. Uh, the dare and the devil <laughs> we have the dare <laughs> and the devil yeah 100% <laughs> man. so yes gd and marcus, and marcus guys yeah. welcome to this show thank, thank, you, you, thank you so much thanks for having this, us man this this is a very open one yeah. so uh don't hold anything all right we're gonna all do right. this one. okay so cool. i'm excited i have been talking about to, to two girlfriends guys. <laughs> yeah. So I, and 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 one thing, uh, I'm a married uh, man with two G- girlfriends. Yeah, GD. If 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 you want to talk, mm. you're gonna have to snatch the mic. Mm. Mm. He gets the mic. Mm. Yeah. Okay. You know yeah. what I mean? That's, yeah. that's how it's going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. That's how if do. if you're gonna ask a difficult question, yeah. he has to Hundreds. get the mic. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so yeah, let's start yeah. from let's start from here. Yeah. He has he's a married guy with two girlfriends. Yeah, mm-hmm. married guy. That is a difficult. That is a difficult question. You get the legitimate kids. <laughs> nah, nah. I'm just playing, man. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm straight. I'm straight. I, I'm straight, man. Married guy, one wife. When okay, that's what marriage that's what marriage means. No, 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 no. Dude, check this out, right? It's, it's gonna get it. Let me tell you something, it right? Out, I so saw it. this documentary. Yeah. This guy has about 17 wives and me? Made four grandchildren, right? Wow, oh, no, no. So no, no, so so check this out, right? Yeah. So the guy is interviewing him, he's like, Yeah, you have 17 wives? Yeah. This guy is like legitimately like like for real, he's like surprise like he's like uh, 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 how many wives do you have my friend <laughs> so the dude is like no i only have one wife hey don't go contain himself he was just, just he cracked up, up. <laughs> cracking up you have one wife <laughs> what <laughs> as if it's an, an anomaly yeah, yeah. yeah. exactly it's so sorry supposed to be uh, it's that an, type of vibe. like okay well, what is normal issue. for me yeah might not necessarily no, be normal for you but, yeah mm, but you guys i'm excited to have you uh why am i excited as i say um uh, I've been a fan of your music for a long time. Wow. Yeah. I think many important. people that are watching this show, probably most of them, have been yeah. listening to your music for 100%, a long time. 100%, 100%, 100%. The dear devils. You understand. I think the structure one, which I will be honest with you, is yeah. when I heard about the dear devils, mm-hmm. I felt like, I think we Yeah. Uh, you, you, t- you take the way. Yeah, so is, is the dear devils <laughs> a satanic <laughs> group? Are you guys satanic? Satanic, 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 satanic brother. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah, it's not even like that. Yeah, and apparently, okay, it's, it's not like that. Yeah. <laughs> no, you, you, you know uh, the, yeah. the, it's it's. Uh, yeah. I'm, I think 
Kuna misconception. Eh kana ngo jiri ganda ga confusion eh. Because I think yeah. it, it it speaks to the fact that we are terrible at picking names. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we are very terrible. Yeah. Because I think when we started out yeah. initially we were, like back in the days I think when we started out uh we named our group Thugs apparently. You you guys were Thugs? Yeah. Yep. That, that was our name Thugs. So, you know, back in the day we had to ask for transport money to go to the shows. Yeah. We had to ask for because because back in the days for you to to, to 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 you had to pay to get into the show. Yeah. Then you had to pay to perform. Participate. In yeah, 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 exactly. So yeah. we'd go to mom and we'd be like, "Hey, mom, my phone and drama." Yeah, did you go show? But you know, those, those were the times of uh, niggas with attitude. So yeah, yeah, exactly. Names weren't really the the best thing exactly. that you could do. Yeah. But but then, if you're going to your mom to ask for yeah for finances and. Mm. If you want your mom to sponsor your yeah. your music, music career, you better have a beautiful name. Yeah. You better be Jesus Christ is Lord. Something like that. You, you know what I mean? No, no thugs. And she's going to like, sponsor you. I, 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 I think not to name names, but you know we came up at the time where we also had Musa family where first <laughs> Musa was there. Mm-hmm. So you're supposed to be uh the, the opposite. Of the that. opposite yeah. of that. Because yeah. you, you know faith, faith had had the whole you know It was a family, like, so he's supposed to be like, uh, okay. find yeah. your family. Yeah. But we was like, now nah, nah. we're not gonna be that. We're gonna be the. Now nah, we were thugs, thugs. because yeah. it was true humble hip-hop. unique guys. Yeah. It's hip hop. It it's was hip-hop. true it's humble unique culture. guys. It wasn't thugs as thugs. Yeah. It was true humble unique guys, uh, and it was uh, yeah. It, like, just, like it was a, coming up to thugs. Yeah. Yeah, so our mom was like, uh, "You guys, I'm not, I'm not gonna be giving you money. Yeah, if your name is gonna, gonna go be Thugs, mm. so if you're gonna be Thugs, yeah, you better thug your way to getting like <laughs> that studio money and that 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 show money." And we were like, "Ah, you know what, mom? Okay, we're gonna think of a different name." Yeah. Then we thought about it, and okay, so this is our thinking, and I'm surprised, Kudi. Yeah. I said because I'm going to judge you but you might be better with me. Okay. This is the podcast. Okay. You're then, free to to drop if you don't book. In any man face, eh? Yeah. Could he didn't send pana bad in the Malawi and that. Yeah. Yeah. Papa Maina. Yeah. Chifo jo onena kuti kuganiza kwa thunta imene yo. Yeah. Inari onena kuti because of the fact that we were like very um yeah. risque. Yeah. Imene yo. Yeah. Like our approach to music yeah. was daring. Yeah. yeah. And we thought in our heads, we thought, ah, daring. We are very daring. Mm. What can be the word that can best describe us? Mm. You know, Tima Panga Nimbo. Because in times when the Nimbo was too, first of all, it was hip hop. Yeah. But I mean, I'm sorry that Nimbo was hip hop on radio. Yeah, it was difficult. Content, it my add my members into Zobala Riga Wambi. Yeah. They do that. Oh, dare devils! There was there was clips though. So you know, dare devils. These are people that that mm. you know they do these stunts, yeah. right? Yeah. So you know you jump over fire, yeah. you do all these things. So we're thinking ah, we can be the dare devils. Mm. So so the cool thing was we go to our mom. We say, mom, yeah, you can continue sponsoring us again, yeah, because we have changed the name. Mm. We are no longer thugs. We are dare devils. devils. So she's like. Ah, that's dope. That's cool. Serious? Yeah, she's like, ah, that's nice. Very like, supportive. I'm like, yeah. Well, she's a she's she's a linguistics person. Yeah. Person. So she's she's a she English teacher. Like, so yeah. she's a good one. I guess one. maybe she 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 caught on to it very yeah. fast. Yeah. So we're like not knowing. That not knowing. Good not knowing. Good. Eh. As a balance out to some vices, I am. Because seriously, um, when you guys were doing the first mix, I think the, the first. The mixtape was the first thing, the first project that you guys had, right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, that mixtape, uh, right? Welcome to the dark side. Yeah, welcome yeah. to the dark side. Yeah. And most of that particular time, when I got a big issue around skepticism on on anything that was coming out, yeah. you know, people were just talking about Saniki. Hey, I think hey. a superstition in Malawi was so hey. heavy that particular time. So people were like, "Ah, my guys, how are we going to work? They are pushing some narrative. How were you guys you know, feeling about?" about uh, were you feeling about this whole thing okay Th- thank you for that wonderful question yeah. uh, he- here's what i'm going to say yeah. um 
I I once saw, uh, you know, uh, like that that narrative that yeah. you're talking about. I once saw something that Dave Chappelle said yeah. about um, uh, a guy that or, or a comedy club that banned profanity. Yeah. Yeah. So it banned profanity and said, well, you, you know what? We don't want profanity in this." Yeah. You know? So there was there were like so many. Mm. Uh, uh, black comedians that were going there. And then one of them said, Dude, ah, you know what? Yeah. Uh, I think I'm going to stop coming over here because at the end of the day, uh, I don't have, uh, you know, an insect yeah. infestation at yeah. my house. Yeah. I have uh, f-ing roaches. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. So so I, for, I, I can't clean you, up my, you get, my community. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not, I'm not going to go over there and say, yeah, you know, this is, you know what I mean? So, yeah. so he said, I'm going to stop. Mm. Coming over for us, me and GD, yeah, it was that situation, yeah, where we were having f-ing problems, yeah, we weren't having you know, like uh, you know, issues, yeah, we were not issues. having issues, we were mm. having f-ing problems, exactly. yeah, <laughs> you know, with this guy, yeah. so we were going at it mm. in that manner, yeah, and that's how we were expressing our music, yeah, and, uh, yeah, yeah, it, 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 it did not matter to us mm. how. Uh, another person is going to it's going to look at it, yeah. the whole thing and and, and 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 to add to that yeah. uh, you 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 have to realize and understand that we okay especially me yeah i'm i'm not superstitious yeah I'm okay a, i'm very far from mm. superstition I actually, yeah. I actually don't believe the devil exists at all yeah. there's no i don't think there's yeah i know there's evil yeah there's Bad people, yeah. But I don't think there's a, uh, there's such a thing as the devil. The, the devil. devil with horns. And no, I I zero. <laughs> I, I, I don't I don't I don't think about. I don't, I don't really believe. No, I, I would actually that that, that is that out guy. there. So you, you stepped out here. <laughs> but like, I, I, this hey, is the guy. What's up? <laughs> what's up with the horns? Yeah, exactly. yeah. Dude, you can just be evil mm. like Too anybody much. else. Yeah, <laughs> but don't put on horns. Yeah, yeah. Why you gotta put on a show? Why you gotta look weird? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, bro, you can just be yeah. like no more and just do evil shit like everybody else. Yeah, so but you guys took it as normal that, okay, people are gonna doubt us, people are gonna name us, whatever. Us, we didn't actually, to be was, honest, we didn't expect it. For us, it was literally just daring. Mm. Uh, what, what, but it, it, it worked out. It, it worked out. It worked out, it, it, it worked day, out that's, nicely that's because like, you yeah. know, uh, we we took it a step further. To say yeah, we, you know we can we can actually do music. Yeah, and uh, I, I I know I'm gonna probably be out on the limb. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, probably, uh, I was on the limb on this one. Yeah, because I, I I always look up to you. Man. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna put it out on the limb and say yeah. Uh, we gave you music that changed the yeah. whole narrative. It did, it yeah. did. And I wanted to, to, to start from there because let's talk about a rap nice. Were ah. you guys trying to set up now your, your space to say, I think we are the best in the game? Yeah. Because at that time, I think hip hop was, yes, there was hip hop, yeah. uh, but I think it was different with what you guys brought in. Yeah. So were you trying to set up your space to say, I okay. rap nice, yeah. I'm the best? Yeah, we, we were. Yeah. I think, yeah. think Dinene Jones, yeah. That is, during, the, go solid, du- during the course of this interview, yeah. Uzi Fusangini, is one of the Yanka. Yeah. Kuma mwina tizi kanga di tukunama, it's retrospective. Yeah. Eh? So tuku, tuku kamba... Yeah. Ah, that's what we were doing. Yeah. Like you, you, you can drop a bar and say, "Good, I say, lai ni mene jai uda uda yankula." Yeah. Umatanda was a goodi. The economic forces, uh, you know, yeah. are messing with the minds of the people. The the middle class is disappearing. I'll be like, yes, that's what I was trying to say. But the truth of the matter yeah. is, yeah. I think, like he. Like he said, yeah. Uh, it was at a time when I think we were teenagers mm. that time. Tinali Mafana, yeah, very young, yeah. And we were growing up. I said, is, is uh, the, like uh, you know nowadays it's like uh, we we started rapping when Panoba Palibe Mutwamene 
ali mwana kuti ndawe manager that can match yeah. us our time yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. we were like really young yeah. we were we were very young and we were going through a lot mm. that time we, we had like a lot of negative experiences yeah, 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 yeah. as like most people would go through at that age so, so legends said it all when i when mm. i said kuti ndinakulandiri mwana so it was it was it was a crazy time but then we found an outlet Mm. So instead of you know getting into trouble over yeah. other crazy stuff yeah. we found an outlet through music. through music. So what would happen is we would just get on the mic yeah. and express ourselves. Yeah. Because and you guys really did express. Ex- exactly. We, we just hey, we just went at it. And and at at, at first yeah. at first the I, the thinking was I say nyimbo zizi sukuti zimvira zimvika pena pali bose. We that feeling right. Hey, 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 hey. When you're dropping the beats, exactly. Is my guys are going to my flash. I'm going. Eh. It was, it was, it was that vibe. Like I'm going. Ten thousand go campus. We're doing the dani. Tigambe. So we were dealing with a lot of things, and we have gone yeah. through. We have gone through we a lot. We were surprised. Tigambe. For sure, we know what you're feeling. We're like, yeah, yeah. Oh, for yeah. real. Okay. But you guys, honestly, let me be honest with you guys. You guys were God because time in a time, uh, the hip hop that was there. That hip hop video good. Eight bar, eight bar. Uh, and again, I go with a hugu. I see Karen now again. Can I go another eight bar? Can I hug a second again? Can I four bar? Come When you guys came, you brought in the. The mix, yeah. where yeah. the hip hop was coming differently. Yeah. You see, so we were like, "I got my guys, wow, wow." And some some people couldn't believe that you guys were Malawi until you were. I think you were coming with. Uh, did you come with the Chichiwa somehow? Mm. Who was mm. doing Chichiwa mm. a lot? I think it was you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It yeah. Was so we were like, "Ah, okay, this guy seems to be Malawi." Mm. What was happening? Were you guys trying to no, leave I, the US I, I, life? To, to be on, to be honest, uh, it was it was JB who brought out the Malawian aspect of you uh, guys of because I think you went below Gujarat. It was a lot of he, a lot yeah. of English, right? Yeah, mm. yeah. So J, JB was the one that came and he. Okay, you, you know JB is very intimidating. Yeah. So he would come and. Uh, uh, because of you know he he, he okay JB respected uh, the setup because yeah. we, we would do that uh, in our own setting yeah. with moms and never so he would come and say that's an interview in that you must in a very good you should drop so it's like 30 minutes so you say eee 30 minutes yeah. so you come over there and then you know what so you start rapping it you go what are you working on passing what are you working on so you Then after he finishes, you yeah. realize it. I cannot do two more verses. Yeah. So he would just say, "Muso guys, at your own time, you yeah. do the rest." Yeah. You know. So that was now up to me and him to say, "Ah, I say, what are you doing?" Jijewa. Zee fe dige jizo. 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 Zee fe I on, but honestly, but, I say, the time that JB came through yeah. and started working with you guys, that's a time that I think a lot of your commercialization came yeah. through. Yeah. yeah. Because I think JB brought in, you know, that time there was a lot of beef, right? Yeah. It was a, it was a game. It was hip hop, right? Mm. What about hip hop? No, it's it, too many things. You know, you you know can't why? Touch this you one, know right? why? Okay. A, a lot of people think JB is a beef kind of guy. Yeah. Do you know why he was doing that? No. You told the me beat, the beats were just they was they were speaking to the guy. So the beat was just yeah. <laughs> you understand? So you're like, yeah. like JB would come. Okay, this is what I, I'm not trying to sell myself, mm-hmm. but yeah, you this should. is what uh, most okay, artists don't, don't sell yourself, but sell your craft. You know? Okay, yeah, yeah. let me tell you. Start talking about selling yourself. All right. Hey, 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 no, hey, no, hey, no, hey, no, hey, no, hey, no, 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 Yeah. He came to me he would come to me and tell me good day. I say pa na hasura. Eh, I say makas. Here is somebody. By dolaba. Eh. E kon drama is. Eh. I want beats. Ah. He would not ask kuri afuna ba beat ya jani. Afuna ba beat ya jani. So he was giving you that creative freedom. So for me, mm. I was I was sorry. I was making beats that were actually giving him the concepts mm. he'll get, he'll get you understand so, mm. so and, yeah, yeah. and and actually what he's saying is with jb what used to happen is you get you you'd give get him like, like a bit yeah. he would, with jb what was happening was like he would get like 15 beats yeah. at one go at once at once 
you come sawa hivi nasa maliza pasa mwaga sasa tabii ma beat tande pasa ma beat you mm. get like 15 beats yeah. and you go in there and he'll mm. do his own thing yeah. so that was like i think that was like the special thing but mm. of course let me let me just get back to a question that that you raised earlier eh? yeah what do okay what did you imagine gani jani yeah mwina kuti mwango imba chizungu nyanya yeah kwa maana to be honest that eh? time ni yeah. so majitika yeah jani na kuti introduction ya to the hip hop industry it was through and how kunja nyimbo za kunja so compare as many ja you try to imitate them Yeah, you try to and, and it's, it's not competing mm. with with how many you know how much you have an analogy in Warren G. Yeah. 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 I in Warren G in a park as low budget. Mm. Why you guys broke? <laughs> Because every time I heard low budget, was it <laughs> is it low as L O O O? I think it was L O O W, right? Yeah, was, okay. So it's 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 low, it's low as you know, you know yeah. low, but it was L O Yeah. So it was L uh, not L O not yeah. L O W but but still yeah. it's the same meaning a yeah, low budget low budget because honestly that was mm. a thing everyone wanted mm. to to produce with you guys honestly exactly and what was happening was yeah. i think like personally like in our minds mm. we felt good uh we were giving a platform to people that could not you did, afford man. afford good music. Uh, you, you know big studios yeah. and, because it felt i think the Back in the day we we had our songs produced at white you remember there was white dove yeah, yeah. studio yeah from a guys and again before you guys started producing your songs we were dynamite we were paying we were paying <coughs> we were paying 10 grand for a song 10 grand for a song yeah and in time in January 2000 and January I mean yeah that's a lot 2004, of money 2004 guy and yeah, 2000 yeah. and mm. it was a lot of money yeah. and the, so our thinking was nah this is too much mm. and when we started doing our own thing We felt good, okay. You know what, guys can come through. I, initially, 2000. people initially we dropped people, it. You, actually, you know, we dropped people, it from ten thousand to two thousand. Yeah, we, okay, yeah, yeah, straight up. And we never charged ten thousand. And actually, actually, it started with people coming to record for free. Yeah, we did. Uh, you did? Was, yeah, yeah, DNM wow. recorded the album. Yeah. The album we recorded DNM for free. Wow. We just gave him free beats, everything. Mm. Actually, we started doing things for free mm. for the love of the game. Yeah. Cool, man. Zero, the culture we were like yeah. I'm going to then this go down this go back single man as it is then eventually because of the demand we didn't know suddenly yeah. there was a demand people mm. were coming we were like hey yeah jambe go down jambe go my charge yeah. so the low budget idea came because we felt good we are catering to that demographic to that demographic of people that we are lagging mm. and you wanted to exactly, promote the craft exactly exactly because the talent is always out there yeah the, the talent is always out there but sometimes maybe what holds them back yeah. is the lack of fun. you guys honestly fun. i should be honest with you you guys are talented thank you talented nyimbo mene mwalo wamo kuti you guys are dropping a beat a, a verse or whatever oh, man, it's you. transformed yeah, and exactly. i think people i would say that most of that is that i know that have made it mm. uh, honestly mm. they they came to you guys with, hey, mm. if i want to do something real Yeah. I need to go to low budget. I yeah. need to have a production and yeah. at least invest with you guys. Mm. But did you do you feel that mugamaona ma guys and guys so we say ma tawe ni banja bene bene like do you feel good you guys you haven't utilized your art mm-hmm. so powerfully to make money. You haven't mm-hmm. commercialized yourself so much. Yes, we have. We haven't. We haven't. Yeah. We haven't. And why? Because there was a time. Let me let me tell you GT. There was a time I was telling Pupa, uh, his colleague. Yeah. I was telling him I was like I said, yeah, Pupa, I would be happy to manage GD. Mm. There was a time. Mm. There was a, in fact mm. I looked at your number. I don't mm. know. I will check other conversation now. Mm. You'll probably find it. But I look at mm. it, I, I, I was asking people like, guys, would I get this guy? Mm. There was a time talking about queer and shit man you want to drama to be that. I was like, I think I can manage this guy. <laughs> because i felt like you guys mm. haven't been utilized yes that's your, true your mm. lines have been in my dropper mm. in those early 2000s mm. Mm. and the word people are dropping now mm. can't even compete true why that's, that's a fact what happened that's a fact uh, you you did not happen mm. <laughs> yeah why i think, think why did you manage i think, I think, I think you could have been I somewhere think, by now eh? i think i think <laughs> no it, you it know could, to, to be to be honest uh, yeah. and and i don't know how people will take this yeah. exactly. and i don't know how people will I, I want to I, like, I hear I, I what want you're going to say mm. and I want people to understand this mm. about this. Yeah. I want I want yeah. people to understand this. Yeah. Like kwambili. Yeah. And this is I think this is something that a lot of people never really caught on to. Yeah. Uh 
the, the, the truth is, yes, yeah. we haven't uh, taken advantage of uh, most of this, like most of the talent. Uh, we haven't taken advantage of our talent. Yeah. We haven't pushed it. Come on, the truth, the tr my truth yeah. is, it's like I never really gave you didn't care about it. it like, just... I've never really, like, you know, sometimes I sit yeah. down, I tell myself, yeah. I say, you are, you have this talent. Yeah. Like, at least care what about it. Just yeah. push it, put it somewhere. And mm. I remember, like, uh, a, a big homie, shout out to J9. Mm. J9 yeah, came up right. to me and he was, like, giving me, like, good game. Like, mm. he was like, I say, bro, blah, 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 channel O. Mm. Blah, 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 MTV base, blah, yeah. blah, blah, blah. He, now he was like on the rail. Mm. It's like I never really gave a, uh, a, I never really cared about this thing. Yeah. Like never. Like the things that matter to me, like the things that I really get excited about. Yeah. Different. Different. What is it that you care about? Family. Okay, I care about family. Yeah. I care about my people. Yeah. I care about a good time. Mm. I care about the music. Mm. But here's a funny thing. I'm at my most excited. I'm at my most, like, the, 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 the moment that I'm very happy yeah. is when I'm in the studio. A lot of people, I think, would tell you that. Like, I lose my mind. Black, black I've recorded, like, okay, I usually record myself. Yeah. So most people don't get to witness that. But yeah. I've recorded at Blackjack's studio. Mm. I've recorded at, like, many people, like, when I'm recording. Yeah. I'm happy. I'm like the happiest yeah. So the, 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 the process of creating people. art makes you excited. The process yeah, of creating it's, it's art for, makes me for, happy. For, and how after that, I don't care happy. who consume it. Okay, good. So, so let's talk about you now. It's annoying. Let's talk, no, let's talk <laughs> about you now. It's annoying how GD gets really happy. Because you know what? <laughs> You'll be like, okay, that's a perfect tech, bro. Like he'll be like, no, no, no. Let's, can, I, can we go? Can we? Can we go again? Ah, Let me do another one. Because oh oh. I'm just having. Dude, that was like like a great time. The clean tech. Like, yeah. Now uh, to come to you is yeah. Um, most of the guys that have made it at, yeah. in court, mm. uh, they have managers uh, in, in court as well. Mm. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, people that are doing business for them. Yeah. You know what I mean. So this like, is the commercialization yeah, process of the it's, art. It's yeah. sad that, um, I, you know, I went through a situation whereby I was at a place and um, somebody came and said, uh, hey, Monata, you know. And then <laughs> I was like, I was never there. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, that's yeah. my response. Mm. So, so did not, yeah. Mm. I've been stagnant. Where, wherever I was, I'm still there. You're still there, yeah. You get mm. I don't have to prove to anybody that yeah. Yeah. but Munata, Munata, Panababali, why would you mention the names? Mm. But then you realize that uh, most of the people they have like uh, managers to manage the PR and yeah. stuff like that. We, we we can do that, but like he said, we just don't give a. F it's just one of those things that happens. We just don't give. A f cool. I think like, I we think can have think, somebody to, think, to, think, to manage yeah, the PR exactly, and stuff. I like. think I think maybe <coughs> at some point the stars will align. Mm. And maybe uh, we'll be in that position where we are commercializing the brand. Yeah. We're thinking ourselves as a, as a brand. Yeah. And we are putting our music out there on, yeah. on streaming platforms. We're doing all those things. I think we'll get to that at some point. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, mm. I think I think that will be something exciting. Yeah, we'll, I think that will we'll, be we'll something do, exciting. We'll, we'll do that because yeah. because you know what? Like at at some point, you you get to realize what you. Now you have fans. Yeah. Now you're yeah, no longer there. those guys in a bedroom just making music. Mm. Now you have fans and you have to think about people that consume your art. Yeah. So you have to think about people like that. 100%. So I think maybe we'll get to that point. Mm. But it has always been that situation where we never really cared. We'll put music we, first. We, we, it's always the music first. Yeah. What happened with the Fredo Kiss deal? Uh, with the, with the Fredo Kiss deal, what happened was, uh, you know, Fredo. Fredo is like our homeboy. Mm. So we've been friends for, for a very long time, and we've yeah. been collaborating on a lot of projects. Yeah. But can can we clarify on one mm. thing? It yeah. wasn't a Fredo deal. It, it wasn't was Fredo. Like, 
It was uh, was it uh, Ghetto Gata Entertainment? Yeah, yeah. Ah. Deal. yeah. So, so it wasn't the personal issue. Yeah. It wasn't like Fred Lucas was signing us. Yeah. He was the company. That the company that you owned that deal. Yeah. yeah, but but imagine like one of your homeboys come comes through and is like, guys, yeah, let's I, work together. Yo, I've always been a, a fan of you guys. I've always respected what you guys do, but you guys are not where you're supposed to be. Yeah. You, you guys are supposed to be somewhere up there. Yeah. You you guys are supposed you you know all this talk right. Yeah. Yeah. You guys are supposed to be making this money and and stuff like that. And we heard that and we were like, okay. Yeah. For real. Yeah. Yeah. We, we're supposed to be somewhere. And he's like, yeah, you're supposed to be making this money. I'm like, yeah, yeah, of course we're supposed to be making this money. Yeah. And I go, but why aren't you? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> what? Why do you think that is? It's like, nah, you need somebody to uh, to manage you guys and yeah. to position the brand like yeah. on, that, on that level. So we didn't necessarily. For us, we we thought, why not? Mm. Who can say no to to money? To, make to money. money, yeah. To making money, and yeah. and when the when 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 the deal happened, mm. um, I think they, I don't, I don't know exactly how everybody thought it's, it was gonna play out. Yeah. But it didn't play out. It didn't play out. Play out how? Everyone everybody expected. Involved. Yeah. Everybody involved so, thought it was gonna play so out. So it failed, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And, and, and then miserably. And 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 you guys are not signed to Fred Lucas. No, 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 no. I'm not signed to anything, right? No, no not really. signed to, uh, not signed to to anyone. Yeah, no distribution deal, nothing. No distribution deal. I think, yeah, no, no distribution no. deal. Um, and and that 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 did not, everything. That, that did not come out as a distribution deal or yeah. anything else. It it wasn't supposed to be like that. And, yeah. and, and it just felt. Miserable. Okay, cool. I have a quick question here. Uh, mm. Quick questions, rather. Um, so I think we're going to take them quickly as much as we would, right? Mm, right sure. uh, quickly, one. Uh, how much do you charge for a collab? Oh. Depends. Depends. Yeah, yeah it depends on what let's, you want us to maximum, do. Maximum. Minimum. Mm. Nah. Bro, no, minimum, minimum, we can even Inbox charge it. nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, cool. Yeah. But maximum, how, how much, nah. what was the maximum uh, charge that you okay. have done uh, to someone? Maximum, uh, pr- no, no, the yeah, highest. You know, some, somebody offered GD for a song, but uh, for, for a million. So a I million? Don't know if, yeah, he offered him and GD turned it down. What? Yeah, he was. Okay, he, he was weird. Oh, oh, oh man, that's a long story. Okay, yeah. <laughs> like, no, no, but dude I, was weird. So let's take it. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, okay, so because because okay, so so you know, I I I ghost write. Mm. Uh, I also do, uh, you, you know, uh, like I compose. I, I do all yeah. these things. So you know, you put that together. You know, it comes to like a lot of a lot of a lot of money. Yeah. Mm. Because, so I guess maybe the, the highest would be. Uh, I've never really gotten. Nobody has actually paid me a million. Yeah, he uh, said no. Yeah, I, I said no because it was because he dude was trying to song, recreate yeah. my song. And yeah, it was he was gonna kill the, yeah. the, the the whole thing. But then, oh, yeah, yeah, so you can you can you can, you can you can pay us you can pay us to the highest bidder. Uh, I need depending, a figure depending on. I need a figure. Mm. We're playing around the words. I need a figure. Yeah. I think maybe the highest would be five hundred grand. Five hundred so grand. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So who is grand. this person who was ja- who was who was looking for Chikon Chikon Who was who was trying uh, to get the I'm, not, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna name drop the dude. We don't even remember what his name is. Can you? Do it? I, I remember. I'll give you. I'll give you five grand if you remember the dude. <laughs> the dude. Yeah. yeah. It was. Uh, uh-huh. What's his name? Huh? The name. It was. Uh, what's that? That 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 dude. Uh, we like I should, should I like name drop him? Do you remember the name? I remember the dude. Oh, the dude, name. What, what, huh? Not the dude, the name. Oh, his name, no. Yeah, but, exactly. but, but I can give you a clue <laughs> who the dude is. Is it a book? Yes, I No. <laughs> <laughs> Of all people, no, 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 no. It was, it was this other dude. It was this other yeah, weird guy. Um, very famous as well. He wanted to buy the song. or He wanted to jump on the song. No, he, he, he wanted. He, he, he okay. Uh, here's what happened. He wanted to recreate it. Recreate oh. it because he heard the song he was in, in the car. No, and he was with a, f- a female, and the female, female liked the like, song. Uh, I know this guy. So he comes to a spot. He's like, yeah. no, I want to recreate the song. You have to write it. Yeah, you have I'm to do not. all these things. So I'm like, okay, bro, uh, I don't think that's a good idea. He's like, now nah, I'm going to pay you a million. I'm like, yeah. uh, And you refused the mirror. I like yeah, it. Exactly. First of I like all, it. I actually didn't think he was going to pay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I would have thought about it. But no, but, but I didn't want to. Uh, 
Because because what we do is like what we that million, we, we, we respect what we do. We respect yeah. what we do. I hear you, man. I hear and, you, man. And the art I hear is man. very important. So, so. you know mm-hmm. you're gonna you're not gonna drop the name. I need a name. I okay, I'll 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 name drop. I'll name I'll 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 drop his name off. Of, of the of, yeah, because I don't, I don't think it's responsible for me to, uh, okay. to yeah. name cool. drop the dude. I hear you. Um, cool. Mm. Um, what's your best gig? You have done gigs. I remember Zuni, you guys came when I was a student at that time. Yeah. Uh, and you, you, it was a good show. With them what's, your, and them. what's your best gig? Let's start with you, GD. What's your best gig? <sighs> that you guys have ever done since the history of Daredevils. Bro, I, I can't really, I can't really remember. It but, was but I, white I'll, I'll elephant you. for me, man. What? Theo's white elephant. Oh, that's the launch? Like, what are, yeah. Yeah. that was crazy. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. My brother. Oh, I man, came out. You, you know me. I'm, I'm always yeah. like rocking Crocs and yeah. always like rocking yeah, like crazy. slippers and stuff. Yeah. I came out and I introduced GD and Zezo on stage and yeah. and we had like the best show one of the best shows bro but i'll tell you this right but we, we, every, every time every time we on every stage, time we yeah. step on stage yeah. Right? Yeah. and you bro every time we I step say, on stage i don't stage. know how I, how i can explain this i say we mama stage but yeah nduguma yanga na anthu yeah eh nduguma ona how they are responding they are responding and they are like enjoying what you're doing i say it's a blessing it's, it's a, a, bl- it's a blessing line, huh? it's a blessing how much how much can i pay if you guys i'm i'm i'm, um, I'm doing something i'm about to launch Uh, a couple of products later mm-hmm. um might be later this year mm-hmm. and um of course i wanted to bring more reggae guys mm-hmm. but if i say okay i need the daredevils to be on this show mm-hmm. how much can i pay for for uh, for, for, for you guys to come to lilongwe and, and perform and perform no, it, yeah. it, it depends because uh, okay uh, uh, let me let, let can i say, and I would say exclusive mm, mm. an exclusive performance you want a live band ah uh, uh, no no no, no. I I I I'm a person who don't you want hip hop or who, do you want a live band? I want hip hop because I'm not a person who who like these guys who are doing hip hop and they bring live bands and they are just making noise at the background. Oh, oh, thank you, so thank you, sounds, you man. Because so somebody had to awkward. somebody had to say that. Because <laughs> ah, you know what? Sounds Nowadays awkward. they think everybody thinks having a live band it's, it's, stage, a, thing. it's a thing. Now it's, oh. the issue is, nipo si jesus masiana. But I hope you guys you're not going to be drunk throughout and fail to perform. Yeah, that has ever happened? No. Nah. We were too drunk no, and you I, couldn't I don't perform. Know happened to me. No, no. no. <laughs> Jit is always shy. Yeah, I have this. Most of the times he he forgets his lyrics when he's not drunk actually. Okay. So the one way is to make sure that he gets drunk. <laughs> Okay. 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 Let, 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 let me say this. Okay. I'm, I'm a, there's been a scenario. I'm a sober, yeah. you, you guys are talking yeah. about being drunk. And yeah. like that, but yeah. I'm a there's been guy. a scenario. Let me let me tell you about a scenario. Yeah. Like uh, we went uh, to Chanko. Yeah. Yeah, so you know, Panai Love is in there, Tango Tuko Kumene, and GD was like, he was a big thing, there. yeah, like, yeah, for real. Like uh, apparently, in Love is in there, people thought he was good looking <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> Now I didn't understand. <laughs> I am a good looking man. <laughs> you know, so he went on. It's that, debatable. We'll check out. We'll <laughs> check it out. Yeah, you know. it's debatable. Yeah. So I, I went. Oh, I went up. Do, I went up. Let's do like a yeah. So a I went note. up there and and you know started performing and yeah. whatever. So I went up there wearing his t-shirt that he was like wearing in the lines yeah. in the air like yeah. So. Uh, Uh, so we had an, an infestation of these yeah. girls just Women getting, coming came out on stage. So I was like, ah, this is not right. So it, it, then he came out because I I introduced him. Because yeah. this is what we do, man. Like yeah. when I'm on stage, I introduce, yeah. the, you know, because I'm the hype man. Yeah. So when he came out, all the girls also came out. Hey. Yeah. Oh, that was yeah. You know was, what I mean. That was it. And he forgot. He forgot his lyrics. Yeah. All, all of it. Like, he was, was blank. Confused. I was, like oh, okay. Strange thing. Eh? Yeah. For some for some reason. So he was like, 
You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I was like, ah, you, you, what, what? Are you? So GD started running away from the girls. Like, ah. And the girls were like, ah, what are you? Just... Um, Love is in the air. Yeah. Uh, that song, it, it came by accident. Mm. Yeah. So initially it was supposed to be a jingle. Mm. For, uh, for 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 mm. a certain brand, mm. and 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 Marcus made the beat, so uh-huh. he made the beat. Uh, it was a nice beat. Mm. So you know how it is, and if if uh, I think if people know low budget back in the day, mm. uh, artists would just come through to mm. hang out. So mm. it was just like a bunch of people there. Yeah, it was so, like a youth center. Yeah, it was like a youth center. <laughs> people would just gather would there and just like hang out and it's exchange it's ideas. A good idea. Yeah. 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 And exchange ideas, mm. and actually, okay, so, so Marcus, why banga bidi jabobo pa pa pa? Yeah, but it turns out, goodi, I think mina mai banga kunu so. I say, nimbo yenu mafuna ati use for jingo ija ija ni. Ndu muzo de iya jingo ija nuna banga submit because I also produce as well. Mm. So I was like, ah, nabanga kwa submit ija ni basi we can't use it. Mm. So the mafuna mina mai was like, this is a nice beat, but yeah. but you you. you You know, it can, it, can, it can be, it doesn't have to be a jingle. It can yeah, be an yeah. actual song. Yeah. So I had an idea. I was like, mm. you know what? These guys are actually right. Mm. This can be a, uh, this can be a song. Yeah. So we started like, you know, working on it. Yeah. Um, so by the time that I gave Marcus the idea, yeah. uh, Marcus was, you know, tied yeah. up, yeah. you know, doing his own thing. Mm. Uh, Assignment. Assignments, mm. you know, school. Yeah. And by the time I gave it to him, he listens to the song. Mm. He told me straight up, like, I mean, you boy doing your Marisa, Marisa. I don't I don't have to jump on this one. He actually gave me an option to remove a verse. Yeah, as I said, I said, Sanka verse, he moved. You know what I said? You know what I said? You know what I said? Yeah. And actually, he told me like, I said, this is a love song. I think you are in love. You are inspired. I'm not. I don't want to be. I don't want to be. I don't want to like, get I'm not, this. I'm not really. But that's how we work. It's like most of the time. Yeah. It's all about the vibe. Yeah. Actually, was, was, all the time. Yeah. It's was the song the linked to your to your wife or something? Yes. It was. Like it was. Uh, I think that woman and I were in it. Yeah. And I was. You were in, in love. love. I was in love. Cool. I, Why are groups, most of the times groups like Peace Square, we heard about they break up and whatever. Yeah. And people have always thought that you guys are going to break up or something. But when I, I'm talking to you right now, I see the vibe. Mm-hmm. The vibe is there. Mm-hmm. Uh, I hope you guys have been fighting inside this. No, no, no. I would want to tell you that yeah. that has happened, but yeah. nah. It, yeah. it, it's rare. Yeah, I, no. I think. I think. Okay. We. Have, we, we, we. Yeah. Yeah. You're as, right. As, we as have people, arguments. Mm, as people, arguments. Yeah. But, 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 but not. not, not we never depart. Because we're brothers. Yeah. We're brothers. Who's the order here? I am. Okay. Yeah. The order one. I am. Yeah. So, so brothers keeper. Yeah. You. You know. You know yeah. how it is. Yeah. So the thing is, uh, mm-hmm. you know, I'm a, I'm a huge fan of his. His craft. His, uh. Yeah. He, he, he. Like, if you can tell me, mention five people. Uh, like five dope rappers in Malawi, dope yeah. singers in Malawi. Uh, four of them would be his songs. Yeah, this guy. <laughs> so they, you know, <laughs> oh, yeah, four of them would be this guy. Yeah, another yeah, guy, yeah, random yeah, guy from Tanzania. Yeah, yeah, probably the other guy that is probably trending. Yeah. But the issue is, we've always been huge. Uh, he he taught me how to make beats. He taught mm. me. Uh, You understand? It's like, a good thing. Yeah. So it's a good brotherly and, kind of and, setup. And he, eh? Yeah, we we practically grew up together. Exactly. I think I think the age difference is like two years, right? Yeah, just two years. And yeah, he's, he's just my, two he's years. My best so ah, you cool. know, we've been like almost like twins. Really yeah. friend, we just, and we do what best friends do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Five years. Mm-hmm. With, mm-hmm. But then again, when it comes to the craft, yeah. like I look up to him Amazing. all the time. And actually, yeah. I, I don't think I don't think uh, I can work with anybody else. Anybody else. I hear you guys. Yeah. Quick one. Yeah. What's your best line you have ever made? Number one, but it was you, right? Yeah. Number one, but Yeah. Whatever. Come on, is like would probably the best line What's right now. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Cool. Yeah, cause, but stereo, you, you know, you, you know, you know why that is the best. Oh, line? stereo and panning, right? So that's okay. That means I, I, I was, yeah, I, 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 I've been, 
having prostitutes yes. since I was a kid. Oh my god. Yeah. Jokes. Exactly. <laughs> See Brother Skipper. Exactly. Brother Skipper. Hey, hey, no, <laughs> but you, you know what why that is my best line? Mm -hmm. It's because I'm I'm still alive right now. Oh, right? okay. Still breathing. I get you. Despite uh, Kopana Vasil. Kopana Vasil. Yeah. I hear you, I say. And, uh, People are going to get this and, in years to come, right? No, no, no. <laughs> there's, a, there's a Auntie Abby that you don't know about. Okay. That knows everybody. Everybody, anyway. That, that so there's a story. A story. <laughs> there's a story. <laughs> Did <it>? Jokes. <laughs> <laughs> brother's Keeper. Yeah, what yeah. we're witnessing here is in Brother's Keeper <laughs> yeah. uh, protecting <laughs> Marcus. <Yeah. laughs> okay. What's and, the best and, line? And there's, a, there's another one. Okay. Uh, the Gompero line. I, I, can I say that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can, you People can have always... Uh, you you know I didn't know about Kumpero until I realized that it's the genital. Yeah. Oh, say it's but, yeah. Uh, yeah. So mm. I, yeah, I used to say that. Which song a, was that? A joke. Uh, I did that in three songs. Okay. Mm. Uh, the legend song. How, how does it the, come? Uh, yeah. How does it come in the line? Ah, ni madana za Kumpero. There's one that yeah. say ni madana za Kumpero. Ah. Uli iwe o uli geto kuli ife za Kumpero. Another one as well. Oh. There, there's another Mpeto line that I did. But that time, I did not know what Kumpeto was. Serious? And yeah. you were dropping it? And then somebody actually told the, me, a, a linguist, do you, a linguist told do you know me, what do, you're do you know about? what Kumpeto and Udi? So, Umadan and this is just Kumpeto. Uh, I was like, uh, you know, I thought Udi Kumpeto yeah. was the same as, you know, Madan was like, yeah. so he was like, no, Kumpeto is, is a different thing. Genitalia. Cool, man. Didi, yeah. what's, your, what's your best line? Ever in uh, your songs, I say, dude. I'm, I, this is gonna sound cocky, but I say every line. I say every line Enjoy. I kick. I say, bro, every line you kick is is always my best line. It's, mm. it's like it's well, it's sad that most of my lines they go over people's heads, but that's no, a thing. That's a thing. That's right? why I'm saying, no, go to, like, trust me. On, I feel on, like on, I feel like that's what I'm saying. I feel like you mm. guys would need a day, a memorial, mm. not mm. a memorial like like you did mm. or something, mm -hmm. but a day that people can remember songs yeah. and people can think about your songs. Wow, exactly. wow. Exactly. Could you, could you, yeah. could you, what was happening? Fine. Yo, it's like even the even like, the lines that are popular good. because. Mm. Like right now, I think the lines that are like very popular and Dajina, Sizaji Bale, Timaziko no longer Dizili Bale, Sizaji Doyle. That one. I said, even those lines, eh, even those lines, even those lines, when you think about it, I yeah. don't know if people know what was how happened? crazy yeah. that was. Oh, yeah, by the way, by the way, your, your question earlier on about the lovers in the air as well, yeah. you know, Guti, all the beats that Daredevils have pro pro we, we've produced, yeah. uh, when I make the instrumental, yeah. I actually get the vibe of GD. Ah. Like even Cesar Jibali yeah. was the, 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 the you know, uh, the Mugudi Jan. So yeah. It's GD who actually made that to be the song. You wow. know what I mean? People think it's a instrumental, like, nah, it's just GD just goes crazy. When GD goes crazy over my beat, you, you, that you is my satisfaction. <laughs> that is my satisfaction. You actually, go, actually, actually, that, that was gonna. Go actually, that was gonna go the 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 love is in the air route. Yeah. Mm. Cause you know he has two verses in it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. In Mogudijan. Okay. Yeah. Mm. So, I, I actually came up with that verse yeah. later on. It was like, like oh, okay. Okay. I see. Yes, I have yeah. to. Did you just say verse nine? Yeah. Goes, yeah. Did you know wow. So I know it was it was it was it was, it was cool. So you know I say every every. Every line that I've and written, it's, it's yeah. true. I've man. never, trust mm. me, and I think I would dare anybody. Yeah. I've never written a work line. Yeah. You have I've never, never written yeah. a work line. Never. Yeah. Okay, speak to the camera and say. Never. I've never written a work line. GD has never written if, a work line. <laughs> if you can come up with a work line that I've written, yeah. the joke is on you because that means you the dumb. <laughs> and I you didn't get it. My, my name is Marcus, and I approve I that approve message. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he has never written a whack line. I dare you. I dare you. Nah. Come up with a whack line that I've dropped. Nah, yeah, he's, nah, he's never, never dropped. Never. Never. I love everything that I've written. Uh, like, uh, All right, like cool. every line. I'm gonna ask you some more quick questions, guys. Go on. I, I want to cover these things because they, yeah, are, cool. they are very important. Cool. Yeah. Why? Um, you guys have ever worked with Mate? Oh, my oh, you've never done any song with Matt. Oh my goodness, man! Like that's yeah. my brother, man. Like have, uh, it was. Mm. We have we have worked with him, but I don't think 
I don't think we have ever done like a, a song complete, yeah, complete song. And these are some of the things. Okay, that... Zico Mo was my instrument, by the way. Mm. Okay. okay, Zico Mo. The thing is, every you instrument that you guys have made, I've been mm. a fan. Yeah. Like I've been a fan because your instrumentals can Thank can you. tell the song. Thank you. If physics wants to have a banger. Because like, <laughs> he runs, he, run, he runs. Facts. <laughs> when Fix is about to have yeah. a banger, right? Mm. He's gonna come to you for yeah, a for, for mm. a mm. because you guys you you create mm. magic. Yeah. yeah, thank you, man. Thank you so much, man. That's why I'm saying that this is okay, cool. So you guys, you remember him? You did the Zico one because mm. the Zico one is the one that really came out when mm. he was when yeah. he died. Mm. People have been playing that one mm. because he really. I think speak, Fred in the, yeah, Fred mm, was there. Mm, it mm. showed the unity and all those things. But also I just got arrested the messaging on that day. Yeah, mm. the, the day but, that you did the beat. Yeah, but, but you know that's a story <laughs> for another day. Mm. But, yeah. Mm. All right, okay, cool. yeah. I'm gonna do a quick one. Okay, so I'm gonna give you um, an artist's name. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just want you to tell you quickly mm-hmm. what you remember. Uh, something that you remember about that artist. Mm-hmm. Okay. So that, that's how we're gonna do the game. All right, Usually cool, when people are checking my my podcast, they always mm-hmm. see. Uh, this versus who? Okay. So I would say, uh, baby, Gomba versus suffix, and people, yeah, you're mm-hmm. trying to create enmity. But okay, okay. I'm okay. gonna give you names, mm-hmm. and you tell me what mm-hmm. you what you remember quickly. Dope. So I'm gonna give you one, okay. Then you say, mm-hmm. give another one, something mm-hmm. like that. So I'm okay, gonna start cool. with you, Marcus. Yeah. Uh, physics. What do you remember? Something quick, crazy. Mm, tempo, man. Tempo. Temper. Temper. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you know, you know, physics wanted to beat up a person. Cause he wanted to hit that person with a car, like <laughs> he wanted to run over the person with the car. Now he, it was the other person's fault. Why did I want you? Uh, why did I why want did, to hit you with my car? Uh, uh, I was here with the you. Um, well, then, so he, he stopped the car. Then he nearly hit the car, uh, the guy, uh, and then he stopped the and car. Then he and to then the guy. came out and went over there and asked the guy. Why I wanted to run you <laughs> over? So yeah, no, no, cool. he's he's good no, no, he's, good. he's, he's, good. he's my brother. You yeah, know. I know, I know, uh, I know, I know, cool, I know. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, but the Fredo case, what do you remember? Quick, something crazy. Did Fredo, yeah, innovative man, innovative outside right? the box. Yeah. That guy, you know, I did also remember Bisa Fredo. Mm. I always trash it. Mm. Come on, always proves me wrong. I said, you remember uh, when he when he came up with this idea? You remember my free shows? Mm. I was like, I said, that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Mm. You, free shows until it became a thing in my life. Then it became a thing because it was like, I'm a guy. I said, tingo panga ujeni, tingo pesa track ina ge basi apanga stage. I'm all this. I'm like, I said, my wife is pregnant. I can't I'm do not, that. I'm not leaving my wife for some free money. show. I need money. I need the money. So yeah, but you you. Innovative. Yeah, it worked out. Mm. Innovative. Cool. Uh, Guamba, what, what comes in your head? When oh, you... my goodness. Mm. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Free-spirited, I say. That, free-spirited. that guy is like, he's like the most free-spirited. Because you know why, why Guamba is very creative? Yeah. Could he chimenech chimabuera murumagemu? He has a way of just expressing it mm. to you and it makes sense. Okay. There's some sense in his nonsense. Okay, sometimes people who have money can influence your thoughts. No, no, but he didn't have money that time. Okay, that, that time was you. Okay, yeah, okay. exactly. Right. When he had, I wanted to be sure music. that is this no, time. No, no, he, he have known <laughs> Kwamba. <laughs> he, he didn't have money. Yeah, yeah, I remember those times. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. have known. Okay, yeah. now I'll tell you this, right? Mm. Um, Gwamba was was generous. Yeah, mm. when before, he didn't have, you, you know, what he I had mean? the money. Yeah. Right? yeah, this guy was generous when he did. Like literally, I, I remember, like he was like, ah, you guys. Uh, you remember that time yeah. we went to? He's like, you guys. I say, I organize transport, everything. You guys are supposed to be sleeping. Yeah, you, yeah. hey, you, you, so, uh, you guys are supposed to be sleeping. Yeah. And it was, it was, it was an environment where he actually invited us to his home. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, yeah. uh, uh, the hospitality was amazing. Yeah. I'll never forget amazing. that. Cool. Uh, for you, uh, oh. GD, mm-hmm. suffix. Oh, suffix. That dude, you, you know, I knew suffix before he was a born again. Christian. Yeah, yeah, true, yeah. True, truly born again. Yeah, I was and and, and when, when, <laughs> when, he, when he came up, like when he started talking all this born again stuff, I yeah. was like, I said, there's no way you can maintain that. Yeah. You're but crazy. Yeah. 
But he has done that, man. Mm. That guy is a solid dude. Yeah. So you ask me, suffix. Yeah. Solid dude. Solid dude, right? Mm. True cool. ball again. Buddy. True ball again. Yeah. Mm. Have you ever worked with David Greenland? Yeah. Yeah. What can you say about him? Uh he's a he's a, he's a pastor for real. Yeah, though. pastor. Yeah. yeah, but he he would he would actually just uh, preach about anything that he's seeing yeah. at that particular time. You know what I mean? Mm. Like so he 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 came um, to me and he told me. Uh, with, with when I was with my girl, yeah. So he told me like, uh, God should bless this uh, uh, union. I was like, <laughs> Do you know how you know? I, we, we have sex? <laughs> crazy, like, really, like you know, jokes. Jokes. Yeah, jokes. But it's <laughs> I'm feeling yeah. like a lawyer. Yeah. <laughs> allegedly, right? Yeah. Putting some allegedly, allegedly somewhere. Allegedly. <laughs> but that's a cool one. Kinky stuff. Famous. Pasta, right? Yeah, yeah some cool pasta. Cool, cool, Perfect. Cool, cool guy. Hey, uh, uh, GD. Yeah. Uh, Blackjack. Uh. <laughs> In that. Behind the camera. Yeah. In that. <laughs> I know. I think I'll, I'll tell you, uh, I, I met Blackjack. Yeah. After he was, he was already famous and and, okay. and big. Yeah. Not physically big, yeah, yeah, but, but yeah. know, like the name was 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 big yeah, and yeah. Was, yeah. he's always cool. been. I think I would say supportive. Yeah. He, the father figure. Mm -hmm. He's always supportive. Yeah. I say. Brothers keeper. 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 I keeper. Brothers 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 you Brothers keeper. 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 Much love for the brother. Yeah, Blackjack is, is a cool guy, honestly. Yeah, He's up. the one who has made this possible, so oh, I can yeah, meet yeah, you guys. Yeah. Shout out to Blackjack. He, uh, he, just, he, he just was, right now. He mm. came to, to my podcast when uh, I had some awkward mics and stuff. Yeah. But yeah, he really, he, he still came. Exactly. Uh, so yeah, he's, he's a guy who was... Very supportive. Yeah, very supportive. Mm. Finally, Shout out to you. Finally, mm. finally, finally. Mm. finally uh, I'm going to give you a few seconds to speak yeah. about this person mm -hmm. and a few seconds to you. JB, what do you remember about him? Oh, crazy. My guy. Crazy. The the most creative person ever. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. the most creative person ever. Yeah. That's that's the second like most, most creative. creative. Yeah. GD, what what comes in your head when you when you just remember JB? Talent. Exactly. Mm. Pure talent. Yeah. Pure talent. You guys are still in touch? Yeah, we're still in touch with yeah. his old brother, man. We, yeah. We his old brother. Uh, I think I think the fact would be Ali Kuja. Yeah. It's 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 what's it's killing me. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? It's I see, yeah, it's like our a, brother though. So like, as a, as a, you know, you know, you know how Malawi misses JB. Kwambi, it does. Kwambi. Yeah. It does. Because Kwambi honestly, JB, JB had this vibe. Kwambi. JB, uh, which yeah. camera am I looking at? Right yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. JB. Malawi misses you, my brother. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I remember. I remember mm. when we did our guys. Do you yeah. remember? Yeah, see. This guy. This guy shows up at the yeah, studio. Like crazy cocktail yeah. idea. Yeah. Yeah. He, he shows up. Yeah. We don't want to do the song. <laughs> Marcus is like, I say, Nkuru yama bera and uzade ngani mbosete. Then two years but, later, I bera some instrument. I got a girl over I'm not really feeling. See, you're feeling the man. So he's like, I don't know, beat it. We can talk about our guys. I'm like, nah, nah. I nah. looped our guys, so, by the way. He has no mm, mm, transition. Mm, wow. Yeah. Like, so, it just looped. Yeah. <laughs> so nobody wanted to record the song. Mm, mm. So it was him and Fredo. Mm. JB is instead of you know bitching about it, instead of losing his mind or acting crazy, yeah, he just said, Okay, cool. Mm. He, he goes somewhere. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, my gene, and punch him in. And they said, We're mm. guys, like, we're gonna do this. We, we, mm. no matter, we have to drink I, I, this, after, and then we have to do this song. After drinking that, yeah. and, uh, <laughs> <laughs> we looped Agazia. Mm. So that was a vibe. <laughs> <laughs> now he had the vibe. We, 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 it was always gonna bring out the vibe. So, yeah, yeah hopefully, the home is gonna, you know. Yeah, yeah cool. It's gonna anyway, come back. Uh, quick one as well. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna give you. Op an option for one one. Mm -hmm. Um Marcus. Yes. Who is a who's a workest rapper right now? 
Uh, no, I, 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 I don't know. Okay, Wackest Rapper I ever? Think, I, can't, I can't think of any Wackest Rapper. Wackest Rapper ever? Can't think of him. GD, Wackest Rapper ever? Yeah, he can't think of <laughs> You're protecting I'm, I'm, the I'm, 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 I'm trying to think. Yeah. With the no, Wackest Rappers. And, and, uh, you know, thankfully, I don't think I've had that. Okay, being a producer, I think I've come across oh, some yeah. very yeah. work. But you can <laughs> very well can't rappers. Go, man, I don't think I can remember. I say, cool. Honestly, guys, um, mm. I have so many, so many questions, but I'm mm. gonna leave it here. I'm gonna put this as a part one, honestly. Yeah, okay. Because I'm keep... looking at, um, I'm looking at the, uh, we lose, we have him no power, mm-hmm. uh, and the cameras have, lo- uh, we've finalized the, uh, mm. oh, the spaces. Yeah, but, but it was great, man. Yeah. So I'm gonna leave it there. Nice. Um, and ask you, probably one last question. One last question. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How would you want people to remember your ass? Uh, You're not dying anytime soon. But no, yeah. I'm not. I'm not dying. Yeah. I, so you, I, you can I, you can I, put it close to your mind. Your yeah, I know. No, I, I I just want them to remember me, man. That's who. That's what. Yeah, and seriously, if I can say they they should because re- I'm prolific, yo. By yeah. the way, you know yeah. what I mean. I'm a broadcaster. I'm, yeah. a, I, I, I'm everything. So I I would just I just want to leave a legacy. But whatever legacy is gonna be. It's up to them to remember me as that person. All right. Yeah. For on their own perspective. In their own perspective. Yeah. Exactly. Perfect. You're trying yeah. to be philosophical. Okay, <laughs> Didi, how do you want people to remember us? I think people should just remember me as somebody who gave them a gift. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because like the music that we make, uh, it's always a gift to yeah. to the people out there. Yeah. So if if the songs that I've I've created yeah. if the songs have made you happy in any yeah. way yeah yeah that's my gift to you so always remember like hey that GD dude mm. gifted me with love is in the air gifted yeah. me with Mugutisha gifted me with all these songs that I love that I enjoy so yeah, yeah that's pretty much yeah that's, cool, that's how I want you to remember guys I'm so I'm so happy Thank uh, one, one question from Blackjack alright you've never done any interview Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness! <coughs> no, no, we 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 actually we actually spoke about. Is Kenny Clips to the Daredevils? Anything? He's the one that made the Devils, man. Yeah. Like we shouldn't lie. <laughs> I mean, Kenny Clips made the Devils. Okay, I gotta be honest. Yeah, man. yeah. I, I think I've I haven't processed yeah. uh, losing Kenny Clips. I haven't. He made he made the Dead Devils. He he's the one that told us, dudes. Don't go to other studios because we were coming up with what music from other studios. Mm. He said, "Make your own music." He literally, I, I mean, yeah. He's okay, the one that that started even low budget. He's the one that he told us, guys. Hey. He told you that you should be making beats. You should be rapping. He said that. He yeah. okay. This is how smart. Wait, 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 wait. This is how smart. He said, Rudy. Clips was because. My father, I know you, you guys are you know, you know, my dope rappers and everything. Come up, come up, studios, and then they're making you guys sound whack. So uh, I'm thinking you guys start your own shit. You know what I mean? He meant, okay, yeah. understand this. He mentored us. Yeah. Mm. You know, he was big that time. Yeah, he was. He was, and I was his his thing. Thing. I'm a fan of boy. You know, because I think I think back in the days I say, oh, we got to go see a CD, go radio station. I'm going to go. Wait, wait, wait. But he was he was like he, he, he actually took time his time to listen to the beat, and he was like, okay, you know what? I can understand your rap. I can understand that. Mm. So he 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 referred. To the, us, to to several producers at huh, yeah. that time, mm-hmm. Peter Nugo, Peter Nugo. and then we went and uh, nothing serious came out of it, and it was like ah, Muguzewa guys, eh, it seems like you guys you would, eh, know what you want to do, and then you start doing your just own just thing. do your thing, yeah, do just your do thing. your thing, you guys, so work, started. work, just put work in the work, make yeah. your own music, yeah, record your own music, yeah, you know, do your own thing. And mm. that really changed our lives because we started thinking. Because back in the day, we would always hassle for some money. Yeah, we go to a studio. Yeah, and that's the only guy. Come that's the only guy that would music that, that was not really. That would exactly give you thirty for. minutes of instrumentals that you would actually just be go whoa, 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 and then be freestyling on it. And like, yeah. rest in peace, man. Come on, man. I'm so I'm so happy yeah. uh, that you, I beat you guys. Uh, I'm going to treat this as a part one. Yeah, uh, please. I think we need to do something uh, with you guys. 
Thanks, uh, thanks for we do something. We need to have a Dear Devils Day because hip hop in Malawi cannot be hip hop yeah. if you guys are not properly recognized. Wow. Wow. People are jumping on beats right now, yeah. saying whatever they want to say. Things that you guys said a while ago, years yeah. ago, in the two, in the Straight early two thousands, you up. really did. Ah, wow. uh, you left a mark. So I'm so happy that we did this one. Thanks, but I'm looking so forward to doing a proper, 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 that. proper when we can jump into your songs and really, like, really get it. into it. Right. Thanks for having us, bro. Yeah. I say, what did I make? I said, don't ask thank you man until next time uh this is focus with my uh it's gonna be another another section coming with the dead devils thank you guys yeah, looking for the next yeah, one dead devils man who's right doing there. that uh, there was a, a guy that went to the States, man, like, with the ah, okay. word the advocate. You yeah. know the brother can beatbox that song? Oh. When we're doing it, when we're doing it live, yeah, show, show, show when, you, show when we're doing it, a live section beatbox, of... Uh, ah, cool, cool, cool. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good one, guys. That's a good one. Yeah.